The Curve Stroke mode in Sketchbook Designer allows you to freehand sketch and then change the interpretation of that sketched object based on specific vector definitions. For example, selecting the Cycle option lets you change the original sketched object to an ellipse and then to a circle. It also allows you to define geometric references such as concentricity. Using a plane of symmetry allows you to create a symmetric object such as this guide wheel assembly. The advantage of using symmetry is that changes made on one side of the sketch are reflected on the other. Once in curve point mode, you are sketching from point to point creating vector data directly. You can draw line segments, arcs, and curves with the option to define points of tangency or intersection. The beauty of all this is that this geometry can be saved in many different formats including AutoCAD DWG or the native Sketchbook Designer format, which supports raster and vector data. The ability to save to different file formats allows this data to be utilized throughout the entire range of product design suite tools. Raster painting and sketching commands allow you to complete your concept designs. The painting commands create aesthetically pleasing images that can be used in presentations. You can even add notes and callouts to communicate design intent.